We met like it was fate. I ran into you downtown and clocked that smile and that sweater. <laughs> that fucking sweater. <laughs> Well into our first year, you moved to Korea. I remember walking our dog to your car, kissing you goodbye, and watching you walk away. I didn't want to let go. But you never tried to stop me because you've always wanted nothing more than for me to be happy. I don't know a more supportive person, and because of that, I'm more likely to believe that this whole thing isn't just an elaborate ploy to get into my health insurance. <laughs> I, don't know. I look forward the most to becoming more of a cliche together, growing old and great together, withering away together, because that's what makes marriage a joy. I'm adding a new chapter by marrying my best friend, my travel partner, the love of my life, in a room full of love. I'm no longer running, I'm staying put. I'm no longer ashamed. I'm thriving in your love. by the powers of sitting me, by the universal connection, and the state of Illinois, <laughs> and with the romantic Alyssa, I love in my heart, I now pronounce you partners for life, and for life, you may kiss your husband. You inspire me to be the best version of myself. You believe in me more than I could ever. You fill me with so much joy and happiness I could burst. So today, I vow, you, I vow to give you the best of me every day. And if I wake up tomorrow morning and find out it was all a dream, I'd go out there and I'd find that smile and that sweater. And I'd do it all over again just to get you back to here. I love you. Oh. <laughs> Damn, that's an hour and a half of eye makeup.